Once you've revealed the roots, I'll destroy them. Antea, what did Abigail mean when she talked about you being betrayed by the first person you loved? Nothing. It not feel like nothing. I don't want to talk about it, Rory. Surprise, bloody surprise. This is locked from the inside. Good money.
Another key. Can you find a way around the locked door? Sense the ripple of a past conversation. The imprint in the velvet is shaped like our mirror. How about a chance to reveal the past? I raise for now the veil of shadows. you no more. What are you doing? <laughs> Foolish girl. Please, no. Please don't hurt him. Whatever's in this mirror is neither ghost nor spectre. <laughs> Where is Abigail? Abigail has left us, my dears. By what name should we know you? Always that same question, and you know better than to ask it, Antea Duarte. I don't need a name to send the likes of you back from whence you came. I've done it before. How does she know your name? It's not Abigail. It's a... well, some would call it a demon. A bloody pest is what it is. You call us demons, but from where we watch in the great below, we are angels. You poor, transparent, knowable you are upside down. <laughs> What have you done with Abigail? She's here, in a way. I am the pool, deep and dark. She is the ripple that spreads and dies away, returning to the whole, a thing no longer. You're possessing her? Huh? We are friends. Such good friends. No, you're a lie. Vapor in the darkness. Really? When you sit beneath a tree alone with no one to talk to, no one to play with, how easy it is to lose yourself. You know nothing about me. Ignore it, Antea. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> Poor, transparent, knowable you. You target couples. You nest inside their hearts and plant the seed of resentment there and grow it until it flowers and destroys them. We've felt you in our hearts too. You came to me. You all come to me. When all you have lost becomes too much to bear. Tell me, little girl, how does it feel to watch the world make ready to pass you by? Do not answer, Antea. You said it yourself. We shouldn't engage with it. I know what I said, and I know what I'm doing. Get on with it, then. You're the banisher now. You get on with it. Right. Not ghost, not spectre. What are you? 
I am I, the bringer from beyond the gates. Yes, yes, we know all about the void. No, you do not. But you will. You will know the void inside out, and you'll know nothing else. Abigail tried to smash the mirror. She tried to break your hold on her. What happened to her? Are you a happy man, Red Rory McGraith? Answer the question. Do you feel hollow? What would you do to once again feel her touch? To feel her finger trace lines upon your cheek? What do you want here? Do you feel guilty for leaving your family behind? Was it worth their sacrifice? Are you ashamed? Do you want to hear it from Aoife's mouth? Your sister can't be far. I... no. Abigail wanted to protect John. To the end, she wanted you gone. Abigail made her choice, but she lacked the strength to live with it. That's enough. Let's get this over with. Let's. Oh, get back here. I hate when they do that. It's close. I feel it. Stay on your guard. Best over here. Can you find a way around the locked door? I take the heart, you take the roots. That's 
why they pay me good money. That's a void breach, all right. Should we jump in? That's enough, Abigail. Step away from him. What will you do? Banish me? Banish poor, sweet, innocent Abigail? Send us both into the darkness? You know well enough, Antea, my child. There is no ascent for Abigail now. There's no escape from the likes of me. Unless I grant it. I offer you a trade, a bargain. Abigail's ghost for John. Give John his due, and Abigail is free. Abigail. If there is still a part of you in there, I'm sorry. There is sacrifice in love, but love should not be all sacrifice. You're in an awful situation. We'll put an end to it. Please. No. Don't send me down. Hell awaits me there. A terrible banquet in which I am the meal. That's enough. We are not banishing Abigail today, but the demon that has taken her. It's a gamble. John! John! Please, help me! I'd help Abigail in a heartbeat, but you are not really her. Red, put an end to this circus. Go back to the Void, wherever you are, and to your masters, whatever they may be. I'll take my prize to the great below, and there I shall face. You are invited to the banquet, all of you. But, especially you and the Eduarte, she knows about you. She knows all about you. And she's waiting. Life to the living, death to the dead. I... Where am I? What... What happened? Banisher? It's over, John. The entity haunts you no longer. I had such terrible dreams. Was it the devil? It was an evil spirit. A bad one. Ah, oh, I see. It were a succubus wearing my wife's face. Thank you, Banisher. I need to... I need to pack up and go.
A hundred years from now, that mirror will still be cursed. Unless we destroy it. Where should we start? Maybe a witch could help. I command you to leave now. That's not the ritual I'd have used. Have another in sight. Did we miss a few? Brought more friends. Change targets. Tormented first. Quicken yourself. There is a path once I clear the way.
This isn't over yet. Heads up! I see no more pillars. It's coming for you! <laughs> 